Hello YouTubers, I'm Justin and today on Dash and Run we're going to be having a look at a Steel Series Stratus uh, wireless controller for the ISO series of uh, devices. Now I mainly got this in to play a game called Bioshock which has just been released on the ISO iPad series of devices. So I know there's quite a few reviews of this product already out there so um, this will be a fairly short review basically. Anyway, first of all, let's have a look and see what you actually get in this box and then I'll show you me playing it on Bioshock. Okay, so this is everything you get in the box. You get a USB cable with a micro USB end. You get a little pouch that is for holding the gamepad. You get a plastic cover that can go on the back or on the front of the gamepad. You get the manual and then finally you get the gamepad itself. And as you can see, it's quite a small gamepad. Next, let's have a closer look at the gamepad and then I'll set it up on the iPad to play Bioshock. Okay, so this is the controller itself, and as you can see, it's very small in one's hands. Um, you've got two analog sticks, which are quite nice. You've got your cross pad, which is also quite nice to feel. Um, you've got your button layout and the letters on it, which are similar to your Xbox. Then on this side, you have uh, four buttons. You've got two top shoulder pads and two bottom shoulder pads. They're quite close together, but I'm sure they'll work quite well. You have a pause button here, a little display that displays how much battery charge is on it. On this side you've got your micro USB charging port and then on this side you have your on and off switch. And on the back you have a Bluetooth repairing uh, button. So that's pretty much everything on the controller. Now it does come with this plastic case which is pretty crap. It basically sits on the top to protect the, um, the, the unit itself, I suppose like a dust protector, but it doesn't sit very well and tends to sort of just bounce off quite easily. So it's not really a very good design. You can also put it on the bottom and I suppose that's to give you a bit more comfort and grip. But again, it feels flimsy and it doesn't sit very well. So my advice is to basically just chuck that away and don't bother with it because it's a bit of a crappy device. Anyway, let's go and see me pairing this up with my iPad and playing some games with it. Okay, so as you can see, it works really well. I'm really happy with it. I feel much more confident playing this game now with the controller than I did on the touch screen. Um, I've always liked Bioshock. I've never really played it on the ISO device and I can see that the graphics have been dumbed down for the ISO device but still it's a game I like playing so I'm pleased I've got the controller and I can play it now on my ISO device. Well there you go, there's a bit of a quick look at the Steel Series game controller and yes I can highly recommend it. Just for playing this game alone has made a great deal of difference from using the touch screen. Now I know it will work with quite a number of games and I will include the link in the description so you can go to the web page and check what other games will work with this device. And as always, thanks for watching and please subscribe to my channel.